breaking news happening now. Denver police are on the scene of a shooting involving one of its officers. It happened just after nine this morning in the area of 48th and Jackson. That's in the Elyria Swansea neighborhood in North Denver. Our Wanye Reese is live at the scene this morning. Now, Wanye, what are police telling you right now? Good morning to you, Amy. We've gotten a lot of information this morning. Denver police have told me that they saw two men were pushing a stolen motorcycle down Jackson Street. That's when the police officers confronted those men. One of the men surrendered immediately. Now that second guy, he ran onto this RV away from officers. I want to get you to some video right now so we can bring you in closer to the scene. At that point, Denver police tell me officers tried to get that man to come out of the RV, and that's when they believe that he had a gun on him. He did not comply and ended up knocking out the back window of the RV and escaping through that window. Officers then chased him and a brief quote unquote confirmation confrontation rather took place. Moments ago, I spoke with the division chief of investigations who shared what happened next. Which led to officers to pursue him and a brief confrontation in which an officer fired his rifle. At, at, shortly after that, the party was taken into custody without incident. The party was not struck by the officer firing his rounds. We did transport to the party to the hospital because of a hand injury that we believe was sustained when the window was being broken out. Again, back out here live, you can see that this is still very much an active investigation that is going on. We've seen the crime scene unit arriving here within the past 30 minutes as far as what's going to be happening next. This is going to continue investigation wise and hopefully Amy in the next weeks to come. We are going to continue to learn more. But once again, an officer did shoot at a suspect, but we can report that no one was hurt. All right, Wanya, we're glad nobody was hurt and this will continue to follow this developing story uh, throughout the day. Thank you.